Yeah, yeah, yeah. This your boy Marquan. And right now we here at the VH1 Hip Hop Honors. What do you feel about the state of hip hop right now? It's booming, man. The South got the belt. They got everybody pants down. But I've watched hip hop go from good to, you know, a little different. What do you think it's right now? A little different or good? A little different. All right. So here from Mike Evans is a little different. What makes it a little different? I mean, you know, they got all these little songs about baloney and all that you know that's like that's a little different for me man always the same you know it's, it's good it's bad it's ugly i love you guys thank you i use you guys for more grist for my show mill what's going on man ain't nothing man i can't call it i might spoil it what's good <laughs> definitely all hip-hop you know what i mean y'all been doing your thing the negro news is what i call it so tell all hip-hop what's going on with jamie right now as far as your acting career uh what what, what, what stuff you have presently in the future when is the why coming back out I know everybody oh, wants man. to know that all right first and foremost the why is coming back out September 10th so look out for that are you enjoying yourself oh my god yeah I've already had like three drinks so what's like an everyday life for like yo it's like this man I came to South Jamaica Queens and I'm not a superhero you know what I'm saying I do exactly what I gotta do I surround I ain't the one you want to stun on Paul pull through I thought Cocktail at your car from the last shootout. I got a dimple on my face, it's nothing. I can go after Mace fan base. Shell hit my jaw, I ain't wait for Doc to get it out. Hit my wisdom tooth, I spit it out. I don't smile a lot, cause ain't nothing pretty. Paul Pierce, I'm here with my man Marquand. Right here, we're hosting a DVD called Born the Ball. So let me ask you a question. I'm here in the locker room with my man Paul Pierce right now. How you prepare mentally for the game, you know? How do you, how you, how you get yourself ready? It just dropped like 30 or 40 in the game. You know, usually like during the season, I got my headphones with me. Okay. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm just kind of tuning everybody out. I got my, you know, at one point in the season, I had my DMX in. You know, I got my Snoop in. My, it depends on what kind of game it is. If it's a game where I feel like I got to go out, score about 40 points, you know, I put that uh, Snoop Dogg in, you know, from the West. And then, you know, if I really got to go out and ride on him, I put that Pac on him. Yeah, and then, uh, you know, it's, it's all a matter of what game you know, it is in a situation, you know, and then I, you know, pick an artist who I think can give it to me that, that particular day. My name is Black Jewel. Um, I'm a professional dancer. Um, I've been in the scene for about 24 years. This is Billy Toga, my manager and personal assistant. We're going to the second annual BT Awards, and we're going to basically turn that mother out. Think of your sexiest... Dancer, think of Genuine, think of Little Bow Wow, think of um, that little girl in that 3LW. Think of anyone you think is a sexy dancer. Now double it. Well, I'm hot. Let me show you some of my moves. Let's roll the tape. It all comes down to one night, one event. The second annual BT Awards show, June 25th. I've been assigned to investigate BT Awards undercover. This is BT Awards. Get it together or go home. Let's work. Are you supposed to be the new choreographer? Am I the new choreographer? Box! Let's do it. We're gonna start with this. And then we're doing it like this. The bullets are coming. Pun the river. Pun the river. Hey, Blondie, do you people know who's gonna be there? Do you? 